Good morning, friends. I'm glad to be with you in prayer this morning. It's a blessing in my life to have the opportunity to join with you at the beginning of the day. Today, as we gather together, I'm going to be offering a prayer about judging others. I'm going to begin with a quotation from Mother Teresa, who said this, If you judge people, you have no time to love them. Let's pray together. Dear Lord, we acknowledge to you again today, as we have on many recent days, that we are feeling overwhelmed by all that is happening in the world. We acknowledge, as we do each week, that part of what is happening is new, but we also realize that part of what is happening is not new, but has been a reality in need of change for way too long. As we pray this week, we pray about judging others. Lord, teach us how to pray for others when we realize they are struggling instead of judging them. Help us to have a heart that shows compassion and mercy to people. When we encounter people, even some we do not know, help us to not make immediate judgments without knowledge. Help us to remember, as we have been taught, that we will be judged by the law of love, the law that set us free. Friends, as we pray this morning, I invite you to think about how we are all sometimes quick to judge others before confronting ourselves and how our judgments often get in the way of our love. As we continue in prayer, Lord, help us to confront our willingness to judge others before we evaluate ourselves. We acknowledge that we have been taught not to see the speck in our neighbor's eye while failing to notice the log in our own. We know that we must first take the log out of our own eyes to see clearly to take the speck out of our neighbor's eye. Help us, Lord, to love others, not judge them. Amen. Friends, our reading for today comes from the book of Luke, from the 6th chapter, the 37th and 38th verses. Do not judge, and you will not be judged. Do not condemn, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. Give, and it will be given to you. A good measure, pressed down, shaken together, running over, will be put into your lap, for the measure you give will be the measure you get back. Friends, this is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Amen. Thank you for being with me today, friends, and have a blessed and safe day. And remember to wear a mask.